Welcome back to RimWorld, the colony simulator of choice. For me, anyways. All right, so we uh, we're we're surviving. We're flourishing, even um, the waves and waves of raiding <laughs> colonies are crashing against the iron bulwark of Little Storping. And the bile, excuse me, the bodies are piling up thick and fast here. So we'll have to, uh, we'll have to keep an eye on that, but I don't anticipate, I don't anticipate having to build more graves just yet. But who knows, Cassandra's been a little cranky lately. I, I, I don't understand. Mood swings, man. It's like insane. First she's dropping, like, resources on me left, right, and center. And then, actually, you know, I'm getting raided. So, all right, we, uh, we're we doing a couple of things. We're fixing our defensive situation because as the last raid demonstrated, it was really bad up here. Um, I think we're going to be in good shape, though. We'll get these two turrets going, uh, top and bottom. I think that's a wise use of components at this point. Uh, I want to start relying more on turrets, at least for thinning out the numbers. Uh, but, you know, we'll see. And the other thing that I might do is uh, I may consider adding another battery into the mix. And yeah, I was going to put another solar generator, but I don't know that it's going to be necessary. Like, this is enough to power probably 10 batteries. Uh, let's go ahead and put another one down here so that we can pad out the energy reserves a little bit. Now, we are, I believe using let's go back to power here yeah like this is powering i think what i want to do is this is a little bit awkward but i want to have this powered by this so that i can turn this off without you know because it's kind of this is powering this actually if i turn this off what does that do what does that do for us? I got a job for you, Marks. Run. Like your life depended on it. You're not going to, are you? Marks, you're killing me. You have one job. You have one job. And Malon's up doing it for you. So what does that do for... So yeah, this just powers this area up here. And then this is responsible for the rest of the colony. I want to see how well this does. And uh, if it starts draining here, then I'll know that I need more, more reserves. But I think we'll be okay there. Maybe I'll just leave it as is, where these just power this for now. Why not? Well, hello there. Marriage is on. Oh, slide. That should immediately... It probably won't, but it should. It did! He's no longer bummed that she turned down his first marriage proposal. I think that was him, right? Want to sleep with Sly. Want to sleep. Why would they not be? Did I not? Oh my good gravy. Uh, Sly... And Christina, there we go. They should be extremely happy. Okay, so there's a couple things that we need to do. We need a wedding spot, but okay, let's just take a look at this. Christina has accepted Sly's marriage proposal. At some point in the coming days or seasons, they will have their marriage ceremony and invite all the colonists. Consider placing a marriage spot if you want to control where the ceremony occurs. Yes, man, this is going to be great. That's good. Well, first of all, the, the marriage part, uh, or the ceremony, is a huge mood boost to everybody. And then it's like a double, triple, quadruple mood boost for Sly and Christina. So they should like never not be super happy. And he's actually going to be very happy because of that huge debuff. That minus 18 is gone now, so that's fantastic. The question is, where, where do we let them get married? This, this is the question. This is the question we have to ask ourselves. And hopefully answer. Alright, so this is a... 
Right, that makes sense. Um, I, I guess it's gonna be an outdoor wedding. I mean, it'd be kind of weird to put it in here, maybe. Last time it was an outdoor wedding, so you know what? It's good enough for me. And what else will we do? Uh, hmm. hmm. I don't know. Like, <laughs> what did I do before? I mean, huh. Let's do this. I don't know. This is kind of dumb and completely unnecessary, but let's put out, you know, some plants, some flowers, so it looks nice. And I don't know. I was thinking about putting some chairs out, maybe some stools, but they'll deteriorate. I don't really feel like covering this area up, so. I don't know. I'm not too worried about it. They can stand around. I'm sure they'll be fine with that. Uh, but what we do want to do, since we're putting these out, is uh, zone get a little bit of this roof area going on over here i think that should be fine yeah we'll just leave it at that squirrel get rid of that squirrel how is there a squirrel in here where are they coming from there's a rat too i don't know how he maybe they were in here all along and i just didn't see them likely the case okay perfect perfect this is good this is very good uh, then that just leaves, um, who? Mal and Marks, right? Uh, Olga is not happy for some reason. I don't really have a whole lot of buffs to her mood, which is unfortunate, but... Oh, good straighter. Oh my god, this might be the one. This might be the one. This might be the one. Oh, yes. I'm sorry, Marks, but uh, you're definitely... You're on this. This is like... This is your other one job. Yes! Oh, man. I'm gonna be... Maybe I'm not rolling in silver, but I'm definitely gonna be able to get rid of some of this crap. Okay. Thank God. Oh, finally. Okay. Synthread jacket, gone. Oh, we're gonna make so much money. Ostrich leather duster. Uh, Labrador fur dust? Oh, what are you, kidding me? You don't, you, whoa, who makes a Labrador fur duster? You gotta be out of your mind. Oh my God, these people are crazy. Oh man, you cranked out a poor alpaca wool duster? I don't even know, like, even poor ones are pretty darn good. Should I sell it or keep it? I don't know. I can definitely get rid of this one, though. Ostrich leather. It's probably cool, but... Gazelle leather. Yep, yep, yep. I'll go ahead and get rid of that. Uh, what else do we have here? The helmets, which we will keep. Although the shoddy one I could probably get rid of. and Maybe rebuild that one. Yeah, let's do that. Shoddy armchair. I wanted to get rid of the shoddy stuff. Uh, wooden sculpture. That's interesting. That is an interesting proposition. Hmm. Maybe I should sell that and build another one. Why not? While well, we have the opportunity, might as well. Okay. Wood we do not want to sell. Uh, granite blocks. Slate blocks, I guess we could sell because we're not really using slate. Hops. Oh, let's get rid of the hops. Yep, get rid of all of it. Yes. Oh, man, I'm loving this. I am loving it. Uh, Plasteel is an interesting... Uh, what do we need? 40? It might almost be worth it to, to grab some of this. I don't know. What do you think? What if we grabbed, like, I don't know, like 15? What would that do for us? That would be really expensive. Man, that kind of sucks. Well, I don't know. I'll think about it. I mean, I don't... It's not urgent that I need it, but... Uranium. Interesting. Go juice. Oh, yeah, we want to get rid of the uh, drugs for sure. Uh, we don't want to get rid of the medicine. I don't think we need to buy any, though. Do you not have... It doesn't appear that they have any... Neutro, sadly. 
Turkey leather. Oh, we're gonna get rid of this. A squirrel skin? Yeah, no, that's gone. Rat leather? Yeah, gone. Raccoon leather? Gone. Pig skin we'll keep. Ostrich leather, we only have two. Let's get rid of it. Clean up the uh, leather interface a little bit. Goat hide. Uh, I guess we'll keep that. Gazelle leather? I don't know. Emu? Uh, eh. Bear skin. Bear skin's not bad. Alpaca hide. And let's get rid of some something here. We're not gonna use all of this. So let's get rid of the stuff that we have the least of. Gazelle leather. Let's get rid of that. Uh, pig skin? Do we need 560 pig skin? I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. <laughs> About like 300 we'll get rid of. Oops. Can I not? Mm. Oh, is that why? Minus 300. There we go. Oh man, we're making money. Making money. What else? Uh, Emu, let's get rid of that. Why not? Uh, bears, can we only have 22, but you know, if we get more, it's kind of useful, I think. Uh, alright, alright, that's fine. Oh, they do sell it. Okay, good, good, good. Whoa, they have a lot of it. Um, I am gonna buy some of this. I'm not sure how much, but we'll start with 10. Alright, what else? Uh... I can't sell any food, can I? Man. That's... Oh, I can't sell any food because I don't have any in here. Should I try to move some over quickly and get rid of it? Uh... Can I put one of these in my freezer? <laughs> Maybe I should. Uh, wow, they've got a lot of Yorkies. And Labradors. Oh, I... F I should buy all these so they don't butcher them for jackets, you monsters. I mean, you know, Yorkies, if you want to make coats out of them, I'm fine with that. But Labradors, come on! Okay. We could actually sell the buck. Heck yeah, take the buck. Beam the buck up to the ship. Because <laughs> uh, I don't need it for anything. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Uh, I think that's about it. Now, the question is, we're, we actually have a decent price on components, so I'm thinking, oh man, like, I, I don't want to, if we make at least a thousand here, I guess that's fine. We'll buy ten, we'll buy ten. I've never purchased components before, and I feel like I'm going to need to start making a habit out of that. What else? What else can we get rid of? We get rid of all everything, all of everything. Cow skin. Eh. Alpaca hide. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Because we will have the opportunity for a lot of uh, leather if we need it. So I'm tempted to sell as much as humanly possible. I think that's about it. Uh, we are getting a couple of things out of the deal, right? We're getting uh, some some neutro and some components. I think that's fine. I do want to make some money off of this though because eventually we're gonna to have to buy some bigger ticket items like prosthetic limbs at some point. Okay, accept. Look at that. Now the question is It's not gonna work. I'm not really prepared for this. Uh, we are making a dent in the food. I don't know. I guess I'm not gonna worry too much about it. I might, I might consider. Mm, what is it under? Slings, I think. What if I did? Oh yeah. Yeah, that's not gonna work at all. Hmm. So like here. I mean, that would be fine, right? I mean, they'd be okay with that. I don't think it matters. Hmm, what will I do? Will I put one in there? I don't know. Christina, what are you up to? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And you're going to finish off that area, which is good. 
before you do that, though, can I get you to haul these things? I really just want to get this stuff taken care of before. And now that we have some extra components, maybe we can consider... Um, some auto doors, perhaps? I don't know. I'm thinking about it. It's on my list. Rut row. Oh, you're building batteries. This was... Well, hopefully you don't fail. Because it's going to get pretty cold in here. There we go. Alright. Uh, it didn't get too cold, did it? Eh, it's fine. It's fine. It's completely fine. What is this set to? 17 degrees. These are all set to 17. Mm, this is kind of cold, so I'm going to go ahead and crank that up a couple degrees. What is going on? Oh. <laughs> I see. Well, how many is that? Eh, that's a decent amount of slate that I don't need for anything. All right, how are we doing here? We're still accumulating, so that's good. All right, so this is going to be the prison area. Um, what am I going to do with this little nook here? It just seems so awkward. I almost feel like moving everything over one. I know that sounds really anal, but it's just really bothering me. Here's what I'm going to do. <laughs> I can't live my life knowing that this is here. It's just gonna drive me crazy. Uh, we'll do that, and we'll deconstruct this. I think that should be fine. Should be fine. You're building on top of Olga. Jeez, man. Coordinate a little bit better. Okay. Uh, all right. So let's go ahead and put. Uh, we're gonna put a door here. It's gonna be a granite door because we want it to be a really a huge pain in the neck to get through. And we'll put. Uh, we'll put our. We'll put up a little little table here. And a stool here. And a stool here. And I think one of these beds we will reinstall here, and then we'll put another bed there. In fact, let's build a copy of that one. There. And then let's go to, uh, what is this? Let me get rid of all this crap. That's it. That's all I wanted. Oh, and I think we need to... Let's take a quick look at the home areas and see. I know we need to do that. We had that set up. Uh, let's make sure we have that in the home area. We'll just do all of these. And that. And this. That way, if the walls get damaged, we'll... Yeah, this is going to have to... Let's clear some of this out. Uh, oh, hey. Interesting. Let's re-expand this, and then let's, I didn't actually set up the sandbags here, so let's do that. There we go. That should move that out. That's fine. And then I think the same thing here. Right for this. It should be fine. Looks good. Yeah, this is much better. This is like five million times better. Oh man. I, yeah, that's good. Okay, perfect. All right, so we have a normal bed and we have a normal bed. That's fine. Uh, what we're gonna do here is prisoners. This shall be for prisoners only. Haven't had a prisoner in a while uh, since Esme and. Vang, I think, was the only other prisoner we had. Uh, let's deconstruct, because that's a pile of crap. Let's deconstruct. See previous comment about craps. And piles of them. Uh, we're gonna get rid of that, too. Not really sure if poor is better or worse than shoddy, but it doesn't matter. Don't need it. 
So we have this poor table, of course. What about this? Oh, come on, people. I hate microing the one person who's good at construction, so I just don't even bother. Eventually they'll learn, maybe. Alright, now let's take a look at auto doors. What is that? True components. I mean, it's not terrible, but what do we add here? We've already, we've completed the battery, we've completed the other turrets, which means we've used all the components we need for those. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, I'm thinking, I'm thinking about it. What kind of projects do we have? I think we should do another sculpture and not use wood. I don't think I want you to use wood. How much wood do we have? 400? Eh. All right, fine, if you want to. Knock yourself out. Uh, for drugs, we have medicine that we're not making because this does it require medicine of six, crafting of three. Do we have anybody that seven and ten? And you guys are both pretty darn good at crafting, so hopefully we'll get to that at some point. duster I guess well we don't have oh hey he did finish it I did you make another poor duster or did I not sell that one I, mean, I don't think I sold it well, that's silly oh well it's fine uh, do we need anything else everyone's wearing that's fine uh, how are we doing here yeah, that should be fine as well and machining table I think we're not doing anything do we want to go and make the armored vests this time? What is going on? Oh yeah, that's going to happen to a lot of this stuff. These guys are kind of plowing through the hay. I don't know about that. I hope we have enough food for the winter. Uh, does that mean this stuff is... No. I think it's only deteriorated because it was outside for like a hot minute. That's fine. Uh, how are these? 88%. Right, well. It's fine. It's very cold out. It's very cold out. Uh, we don't have the warm clothes alert though, so I'm assuming everyone is perfectly toasty in whatever they're wearing. I really am irritated that Christina's not wearing a parka, but whatever. I wish you could, like, forbid colonists from bothering other colonists while they're sleeping. But that's not a thing, sadly. Okay, I was going to... Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's do that, and let's unsuspend this. Because then we'll have the two... Of the two helmets, right? Or no, I sold one of the helmets because it was terrible. And we just have the one, so let's actually add another helmet there. Yeah. Okay, we've got lots of neutro, we've got... Uh, I think we're pretty much fine here. I wish it would stop making noise. I know, stuff is dying, you don't have to tell me. Oh, you know what? I forgot to turn this on. Shoot, Christina. Why is that not on? I mean, I know, I get it. Oh man. <laughs> Hope it gets warm quickly, quickly before it all dies. That was not very smart. I forgot about that. My bad. Okay, minus three. I think we should be fine. Not an ideal temperature. Yeah, I get it. There we go. All right, it's still kind of cold in here. Guess we'll crank this up a little bit. Man, we only have this one area. Hmm. Well, the ones that died, it's gonna take a long time to uh, to 
get back on track, but no, well, such is life. I just want to make sure that we don't run out of food for these guys through the winter. I'm kind of glad I got rid of that deer now. Make simple helmet completed. Yes, it's a shoddy helmet. You suck, Vang. I can't believe it. The thing that kills me is that, like, man, crafting is pretty high. It's pretty high. I feel like I'm justified in complaining about the quality of work that he's doing. But whatever, it's fine. Marks is building another sculpture. I think I want to put it in here. Just please don't be about to sell. Black Cliff. It's a poor sculpture, of course. A depiction of Sly Marks deeply kissing Christina with few clothes in sight. Oh, man. Okay. This is a little risque. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure I was going to cheer anybody up that's hanging out in the uh, infirmary, but... <clears throat> Okay, uh, things are going okay. Oh, yeah, this filled up quite nicely, very quickly, as I anticipated, but it's fine. So the next thing we want to do now that we have, hopefully we'll get a couple of decent armor vests out of this, and then I think we'll be in good shape to take a couple alpacas and go back for some retribution. Show the uh, owners of Strife how it's done. Get a proper invasion going and kill some fools. I'll be very disappointed, though, if I show up and there's, like, 14 people there. But I guess we'll, I guess we'll see. Uh, I don't know. I, I think I'm just going to have her make another one. I don't really want it. Pours is only 25. That's not that great. It's not that great. Alright, Sly's cleaning up the place. That's good. That means we're running out of projects. Did we fully... Clean this up? I guess we did. Uh, do we have... I was working on it. Man, we are taking forever. How's your, uh... Hmm. Alright, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Yes, here we go. Normal. Alright. It's okay. I am generally fine with that. Everyone is so happy. That's a pain. He's still mad about this. Now that they're getting married, though, hopefully he'll stop hitting on Marks and just, you know, not suffer a massive hit to his mood for being an idiot. All right. Uh, hmm. I wouldn't mind having more stuff filling these things out, but, I mean... Honestly, we're not really getting a whole lot of melee fighters these days. Most everyone has a gun of sorts. Uh, I've got lots and lots because we uh, managed to finally pick up the steel here. Our reserves are bolstered appropriately. Uh, I'm just wondering. Ooh, this is it. Compacted plastic steel. There we go. That's what we needed. All right, let's go ahead and get this stuff. Mind out. What? What? Yeah, okay, that's fine. Just want to make sure it wasn't this stuff again for some reason. Yeah, I know. It's all going to die. Just get rid of all of it, please. It is freezing out. April, May is fall. Man, I, <laughs> I don't know how cold it's going to get in winter. It's going to be a lot. And she's going out to mine. That is a long ways away, but... It's all right. Okay. Um, 
feeling like maybe these traps here's what i'm what i'm thinking maybe we remove these traps right because it's not as useful anymore but what we do is maybe line some traps around here because that's where people are likely to uh hang out there's not really a whole lot of cover anywhere else now what we could do is set some artificial cover and then put traps all around it as sort of like a lure uh, be kind of cool right if it works i don't know would it work did you actually get any of that mind no not even close uh but yeah we certainly don't need those around anymore and I don't think we have any left up here, so that's fine. Mm, yeah, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to worry about it just yet, though. We'll see, kind of, maybe if we get raided again, we'll see how that works out. I do know that, well, I'm kind of curious to see what they'll do now that this is gone. Like, where are they going to hang out? Are they going to hang out in, like, these areas? Do I need to, like... Line this out so it's straight. They'll do that. Uh, might be overthinking this a little bit, but. I wonder what's in here. What happens if I claim this? I can't unclaim it. Oh, like I have to claim the whole thing? Oh, whatever. Uh, let's deconstruct that, just see what's inside. I don't know if you can find things in here or what, but... I just have to keep an eye out, make sure it's not like an ancient evil. Is Christina going down here too? Yes, she is. Yep, that's the ancient danger. Stop. Abort. Absolutely do not open that up. That's really close to me. As Christina draws near the ancient wall, a sense of foreboding overcomes her. She isn't sure why, but she feels that this dusty structure may contain a great danger. Uh, I think that's the crypto sarcophagi or whatever, maybe? I don't know. Like, I had, I had one of these in my last game, but I don't remember it doing anything. But just my luck, it'll probably... Okay, so we got a sculpture, and we have another vest. Perfect. Excellent. And it's poor quality. Man, Vang, what is wrong with you? Are you just, like... Get your head in the game, man. Get your head in the game. I need you at 100%. You're not at 100% right now. All right, well, I think that uh, just about does it for this episode. Uh, we have got most of the things ready. I think we're very close now to embarking. I don't know if it's a good idea or not to actually employ a caravan in when it's this cold. I don't think it matters, but I don't know. We're going to find out. We're going to we're gonna seriously consider our options in the next episode, I think. As long as Christina, or not Christina, <laughs> uh, Cassandra, Cass, doesn't throw anything too crazy at us, then I think we're going to give it a shot and see what happens. Um, anyways, thanks so much for watching this video and join me next time.